Well, Bass Central Open number two did not go as I had hoped. It's pretty evident from my finish somewhere in the low hundreds. There's a good little large mouth on the square bill. The way the last couple days have gone, I'd take five of them. Give me 10, 11 pounds. Definitely be a good start. Just typical river fishing. Come over a little log with a square bill and there he was. These first few clips are from practice, and practice was not good by any stretch of the imagination, but it was much better than the turn. That down here loaded up on the old crankbait. As is often the case, I typically make better decisions when I'm fishing by the seat of my pants, so to speak. In practice, covering a lot of water, you see here, I was fishing a worm, and I said, you know, it'd probably be a good spot for a crankbait, and I pick him up, and there we go. Too perfect, dude, too perfect. <laughs> Oh yeah. There's a good one. With the old crankbait. The series five on that butt. Solid fish. A solid fish, especially for this place. That's a good one. There were several different little feeder creeks and rivers that all merged here to make the Arkansas River in Muskogee, Oklahoma. And there's a lot of variety. There was some really, really stained water, some slack water, some clear water with a lot of current. And you see here, I caught a nice little spot on a Strike King Rage Menace, a new little bait that I rigged up on a shaky head. And it got me several bites in practice. Here's another small fish on it. And all these keepers, uh, they were few and far between in practice, but even more so come tournament time. Uh, limit went a long ways, 14 inch size limit, so five fish would weigh. 10 or 11 pounds and um, most of these fish were good and chunky and eating the bait good but tournament time came along and things changed. This was keeper number two about 10.30 in the morning. I was pretty frustrated at this point because things hadn't gone as planned so far, but trying to piece together a day and glad to get this one in the boat. I actually had to resort to old ribbon tail, plain seven inch black worm to get a few bites. Day one saw only three keepers in the boat. So uh, like I said, it was definitely a bad day. Tried to turn things around on day two. I started day two in the back of a little muddy creek I'd found, had a lot of brush, a lot of shallow stuff, figured I might get lucky and get a three or four pound bite. Didn't work out that way, I did catch two keepers pretty early and this this fish here is my second and last keeper of the day. I hoped I might be able to run back out to the river and maybe catch some on the square bill in series five and the worm, but it did not work out that way. And that's how it goes, sometimes you catch them, sometimes you don't. These first two I definitely did not, but Right now, for the next month, Ross Barnett's on my mind. It's my last shot at the Classic unless I fish the wild card. And Right now, I'm studying up and getting ready for it. Better show in there.